All right, welcome back everybody. Uh, hopefully you're home safe, sound and nice and warm because it is frightful outside. Look at that snow in Monarch and East Glacier. Not much different. It's been snowing for hours around East Glacier where there's a blizzard warning in effect here. Rogers Pass, a uh, change required for uh, tow vehicles. Looks like we've got a little backup of some some cars here, some brake lights heading uphill. That's not a good uh, deal anytime. And uh, around Bowman's Corner, Highway 200, there you can see the road covered with snow. Boulder Hill, it's starting to pile up. And Interstate 15 through the Dearborn area, the snow is coming down really uh, heavily as well. In Great Falls, 16 degrees with an east wind, not too strong just yet, but the wind chill is 6 degrees. It's not just about the snow here. We'll also have record cold here this weekend and in Helena. Boy, it's uh, snow. Got about an inch of snow already on the ground. 25 degrees currently feels like 18 when you factor in that light little wind. Teens, 20s, couple of spots uh, above the freezing point. Butte America actually the only one at uh, 33 degrees. Uh, here's uh, the wind chill. The future track feels like now going through tonight into tomorrow morning. Wind chill value dropping below zero here tomorrow snow all day long not the strongest wind but there will be a wind and that will create a wind chill high temperatures only be in the teens wind chill values likely below zero and then through Saturday night into Sunday morning as Arctic eye pressure moves into the state that's when some wind chill values could approach 30 below zero that's really cold for the middle of January and here we are at the uh, next to last weekend of October Blizzard warning. This is where the travel conditions will be the worst. Uh, folks living in this area are used to the drill here, so to speak. But uh, just please be careful uh, out there if you have to travel all tonight and all tomorrow as uh, that blizzard warning continues to be into effect. There's the snow spilling out now into eastern Montana, really expanded quickly across the state, and it's accumulating quickly with how cold it is out there. Uh, there you can see some of that snow again uh, around Great Falls, pretty heavy. We've got the snow where we've got the uh, blizzard warning there right off of the Rocky Mountain front. So through tonight into tomorrow morning, snow and cold and all day long tomorrow. That snow will be around here with the exception of extreme northeastern Montana and the extreme northwestern part of the state uh, won't see quite as much if any snow here, but the snow continues through most of the day. But in the afternoon, that northern edge will begin to shift southward here and the snow will be breaking up as we go through Saturday afternoon and Saturday evening. Now overnight into Sunday morning, high pressure moves in the clouds break up here with the snow on the ground with Arctic high pressure settling in right overhead. Likely most of the state waking up the temperatures between zero and 10 below zero. Some of the normally colder spots on Sunday morning, 20 degrees below zero. Yeah, we're going to shatter these records again. These temperatures typically not found here in the end of October and typically you don't see snow like this. This will likely be a record breaking storm for temperatures, but also for the snowfall here through the central part of the state is where we'll see the heaviest amount. So what you can expect by tomorrow around this time, as much as 16 inches into the hills around Helena, Great Falls, as much as 14 inches of snow, solid foot through most of the Great Falls area. Same goes for Lewistown, a little lighter amounts, but more wind and tricky travel up there around Cup Bank, and you can see the snowfall tallies go a little lower, a little lighter the farther east you get out onto the high line. Single digits and teens here tonight, and this isn't uh, even as cold as we will be here for uh, tomorrow night and Sunday night, but uh, dangerously cold out there and dangerous on the roads. A lot of crashes already. Here's the forecast for tomorrow. Snow through most of the day. The snow works its way southward, breaking up as we go through the afternoon, the evening. Highs only in the teens. Remember, wind chills will likely be below zero. High pressure, Arctic high pressure right overhead for Sunday. So it starts out brutally cold. We'll have sunny skies, high temperatures getting up into the teens here on Sunday and then heading into Monday. A little Chinook starting to develop. Blowing snow could be an issue across north central Montana after we have this light fluffy powdery snow and then the wind starts to pick up and then heading into Tuesday. There goes the warm front. Look at these numbers up above the freezing point for many locations. Here's the seven day forecast for Helena. Cold tonight, tomorrow, record cold, likely Saturday night and Sunday night, and then a slow warm up as the valley will be inverted Monday and Tuesday. But 
Even the Helena Valley warming up above the freezing point Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. We're back up to 50 degrees. That's almost average. And four great falls dangerously cold tonight. Tomorrow record lows Saturday night into Sunday morning. And then that wind picks up on Monday and that Chinook wind will warm up into the 40s and 50s next week.